Now we're checking in with Arthur Cade for today's Hollywood Insider. We are surrounded by hostile forces. We are running out of ammunition, food. I know what we're up against, Harvey. No one is coming down. After five terrific seasons, Gotham on Fox is coming to an end. And I'm at the Paley Center in New York chatting with the cast about saying goodbye. It's bittersweet, you know? It's, it feels like um, we've accomplished what we set out to accomplish. Uh, we love the people we work with. And I keep saying it's time. like ending high school, graduating. You know, it's bittersweet. You've created a family, but you're moving on. There have been so many artists over the years, whether they're actors, directors, writers, comic book artists, who've contributed to this incredible story of Batman and Gotham. For us to, to put our little small part, I think that's meaningful. What was it like saying goodbye? It was very emotional. I was directing the episode. It was a really, for me, beautiful end to, to the story. It was cathartic, but then at the same time, like, sad but not sad, because these are my dearest They're family. friends, They're family and I'm not saying goodbye to them ever, so, yeah. Because there will be a reboot of five years. <laughs> Your lips are gone to yours. Every single day it blows me away. I, I, I had no idea what kind of world we were stepping into when I started Gotham, and being a part of a 75-year-old mythos is amazing. You have a built-in fan base who are so devoted and so passionate. Their social media presence is awesome. It's beyond words. I'm forever thankful. They're just really invested in the characters, and I think that that's a beautiful thing. You don't get that kind of audience for every show or every movie, and I think it's really special. It's a fantastic way to end. We knew we were ending, and so like, yeah, it's great. It's gonna lead us off to awesome projects next. Catch the final season of Gotham only on Fox.